woman is now charged with setting a fire that killed her legally blind boyfriend. This happened last Tuesday near 28th and Bobolink. Our Bill Miston explains prosecutors say the woman told police she started it because of a fight. Stephen Ted prosecutors charged Michelle Adams over the weekend with the fire that killed her boyfriend. A fire that prosecutors say Adams set because of a fight the two had earlier in the day. This is working fire going off at this time. Police and fire crews showed up to 28th and Bobolink shortly after 9 Tuesday night. Court filings say a firefighter heard a male voice yelling help three or four times. Then the pleas for help stopped. Firefighters searched the basement and first floor. We got three firefighters, second floor for an inner search. Minutes later, you count on the second floor. A call crackled over the radio. There's a seat, victim second floor. 60 year old Anthony Winters was pronounced dead. On Saturday, prosecutors charged his live in girlfriend, 62 year old Michelle Adams who also goes by Diana Johnson. Court filings say Adams was found sitting on a rock across the street from the fire. A witness told police Adams said, I set the house on fire and began to laugh. And a blind man in there. That's what he gets. As the witness could hear the man crying for help. Court filings say Adams told police that Winters abused her and pushed her out of her chair earlier in the day. Prosecutors say Adams admitted to starting the fire on a mattress Winters was sleeping on and told Winters to get up and put the fire out and ran out the door. Filings say Adam said Winters had a choice to get out. A commissioner set Adam's bond at $200,000. Fox 6 reached out to an attorney representing her. We haven't heard back. She is due back in court on Friday. In Milwaukee, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News.